Amigas gang. We are It's Amigas. And I feel like we're smack even and it's fine. Today, guys, we're going to be doing, well, we did a, um, oh, um, a mango. Mango, guys. So for those of you who are Dominican, Puerto Rican, and, you know, if you're Spanish, you might know what this is, but for my Dominicans, mango is sma smashed plantains with a little love. And these are pickled onions and yep. fried tropicana cheese. That's what it's called, tropical. Yeah. Cheese, tro whatever, tropical, whatever. Mm. Um, this was this video was requested by somebody. I don't remember exactly who it was. I know. Well, no, well, we'll look at it live and yeah. like, just add you at the bottom in the mm -hmm. comments. So, the person that picked this mukbang <laughs> is also um the person who picked the topic, and the topic is. What's the worst and best part about being Dominican? So, uh, I'm gonna just eat a little bit because I'm starving and then we can know, get into I'm starving. that. Like, I'm really starving. We, we, went, we came out of work and then we just went straight into this. And I, I feel like I have Dominican coffee. Mm -hmm. That is the only one I have. we have left. I feel like I have one of these in your lifetime. You're not Dominican. You're not Dominican. I don't have any more, but. So while we eat a little bit, we're gonna show you guys us making the black tunnel. Yeah. Oh. See, I don't know how it's gonna go down. So guys, we're about to start cutting. I am not cutting this. I've never been good at cutting platanos. Um, I can cut a platano with acrylic nails. As you can see, I have no acrylic nails. So we're gonna see how this is gonna go down. Um, my should be looking real squiggly. You guys already know from from the platano video because I can show you guys. You can go back. I'll put a little snippet of it of me and Jenny competing with the platano. Look at this squash. <laughs> Whoa, inappropriate. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're gonna yeah, cut and get special. ready. Hold on, I wanna see if I could do it. Oh. This knife is too good. It's looking real fresh. Alright, alright, we're getting somewhere. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Alright, so we're valid, it's safe. Okay, that's all. Oh, I just got mad at these because they're like little. Yeah. I don't know how many. But I. What do you want? Okay. So, so I'm telling the people that I'm calling you so you can teach me how to make this bamboo. What do I do after it boils? After you boil, you take out the hot water, you put cold water. Oh, you see? You all the hot water? I thought you needed the water. No, you don't need the hot water. You put cold water? Because if you leave the hot water, that's what's going to stay hard. So you take out all the hot water and you put on my hot lake with cold, cold, cold water. All right. And put so ice if you want to. All right, ice? You don't really need ice, but hot water will do. All right. So season water. The biggies are real, real thingy too. What do you know, bougie thing? So what the man has done? Mm -hmm. And that's it. Mira de mantequilla. And that's it. No, no that's it. Yeah, but you, you put much? salt in the water. Yeah, I put salt. So huh? I add a little bit of garlic and I go oh. get black pepper. I said no, she don't add garlic, and she's like, yes, sir. Is you that good in water, Jenny? Is that good in water? Well, you gotta, you gotta um, mash up before. I before the water. You gotta need oh. That's good water. That's good, that's good. No. That's bad. And then go. Oh. Damn. You just have to do all right, the, the mud. Go ahead. One thing. I love about Dominicans. Dominicans. I love how. I love how we all do the same thing and we don't even live in the same household. Like every all Dominicans do the same exact thing. Like sorry guys, I'm talking. I love how anywhere you go, you meet a Dominican, you automatically feel like they're your family. Yeah. Like it's like automatically like if, if I'm in a in a corner store and a Dominican auntie cusses me out, I'm not even gonna say nothing. I just feel like she's already my auntie. Yes. It's like one big family. Even if you're not family. Mm -hmm. I love our lingo. 
Nobody talks like a Dominican. Only Dominicans talk like Dominicans. Like, yep. We don't sound. You, you will never get us confused. Ever. We sound. We be sound. <laughs> we be saying the funniest shit. Spanish ones. Um. Mm. 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 I hate how Dominicans make up a name for everything. Like, bro, they change the name to everything to make it what they are, and that's what they don't call it the proper thing. They call it something else. Yeah, and that's why Spanish be all fucked up. Like, pads, for example. There's a brand called Kotex. I think it is. Mm-hmm. Oh. Um. You're supposed to say toalla sanitaria. That's how you say pads in Spanish. But Dominicans say cote. Cote. <laughs> cote. Yep. Like another one is um a shirt, like a like a polo with the, with the color. Um Dominicans say it's supposed to be like blusa or something. Camisa is supposed to be camisa. Or something like that. Yeah. Dominican saying polo che, which is polo shirt. And it's like as you got all the like polo polo shirt, cereal, Cheerio. Cheerios the brand they call it Cheerio. Every every cereal is Cheerio. What is it Cheerio that's That shit and that's it. That's yeah. hilarious. Like um, wow, a bunch. There's a bunch of things. Jeepeta. <laughs> Jeep. Yep. Um. Hampe. Hamper. Hamper. And this is like regular lingo. Like this is not even like you don't know. Like I'm not gonna know. Un hamper. But un hamper ahí. People don't understand us when we talk like other people. Who speak Spanish don't understand us sometimes because we did have our own mm -hmm. language. But honestly, I'm so glad I am. Yo, I love the Like, there's nothing yeah. better to me, like, no offense. I love all my people, but. No, no, no. I'm not book, so. <laughs> I'm a moon. Yeah. There is a oh, Jesus. You don't think there's a little bit of that. But yeah. That's hilarious. One thing I hate, but love at the same time, is how embarrassing the Dominicans are. Like I love and I hate it at the same time because it's just so funny. And you you're laughing at me like fuck the man. Here we go. Mommy! The old man calling you mommy. Mm -hmm. Mommy. Yes, no one can you please. You can do algo. You can do blah 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 blah. And they're mad loud. Oh. And the thing calling you just Roberto! Yo lo tenía a ti. Yo tenía a ti que no dinero, que no no ponga mano. <laughs> what about when you go shopping with your mom, right? And you get to the register store. And the item said over there was 12.99. And when you get to the register it says 25.99. And your mom goes, "No. Right there. No, 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 no. Dile que no. Tell him I don't want. Dile que no, que no. No, eso dije allí dijo 12.99. Cinco no veinte nuevo. Dijo allí. That that drop prices. That's just so embarrassing. That you're around these classy ass people and your mom's mad loud. Like no 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 and no one here. No no one here. Take it. Take it off. Take it off. Mad embarrassing. Like sorry. Oh, the mini is not free shit. So yeah, anything free there there. Yeah, I do. We was in Walmart, I went to Walmart with my mom. And through the last speaker, our lady said it was giving free shit. I'm like, yo, watch my mom come with a little free something. Sure enough, she just said the word free. free. <laughs> and she went to the back of the store and claimed her gift. Um, what else? 
I hate how tardy Dominicans are for everything. Like, they're so late for everything. Like, you have to give them a fake time in order for them to get there mm -hmm. on time. Like, yep. you did have to put a fake time. Especially the aunties that have, that you tell them to do a dish for the party, you're walking in the party with the dish with all the people there. That's not okay. Mad late. That was my mom. Everybody used to wait for her dish you know, because she was always mad late. Mm -hmm. well, that's my mom's pet peeve, yo. She ate food. Now, nigga, so they, they, nigga, now they make her drop her shit off early because they know. Oh, guys, I'm getting full. But honestly, like I said, if, actually, if you could be anything else besides Dominican, what would it be? Because I would be Colombian. I would be Colombian, sweet. 100%. Colombians are lit. So, Colombians are so lit. And what other? I'll probably be Cape Verdean. Cape Verdean, yep. I'll be Cape Verdean. Cape Verdean, Ethiopian. Um, something where they like sell it, like they're very like, like either, it's either, either like, I can't be like it, in the boring like setting, like people who like are happy, they 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 party. They oh, I can, I'll be Caribbean, like I'll be mm -hmm. from the Caribbeans. Yep. That's another West thing Indian. I mean. Yep. The whole West Indian shit, I'll be. Cold. But definitely my second pick would be Colombian. Food wise, I'm gonna have to go with the Puerto Ricans. If not Dominican, I, you know Puerto Ricans are our rivals a little, but we can't just say. As Dominican, mm -hmm. I would rather be Puerto Rican, never in this lifetime. No offense. <laughs> but Puerto Ricans could cook. Mm -hmm. So like food wise, my next up would be Puerto Rican. They do cook there. Cause they I cook love Colombian food though too. Colum the Colombian app appetizers that we have. I feel pastries. like Puerto Rico is the closest to us food wise. Mm -hmm. In Caribbean. But like mm -hmm. Ours is like the way we season it. Mm -hmm. I just love it. And everybody that goes to DR, besides the annoying rumors and the um, stuff that happened, which was not our fault, mm -hmm. that had nothing to do with Dominicans. All the Dominicans don't have nothing to do with the actual country. Because remember that all those resorts are owned by Americans and Europeans. So blame it them. Yeah. All because it happened in our country doesn't mean it was us. But back to the story. But my thing though too is that that happens in every country and like for some odd reason it just kept happening. Like everybody knows when you go out no, of the country. No, for some odd reason they just kept talking about the Dominicans because that happens. And if you look at the rate, Mexico got a crime every day. We've been chatting for a long time now. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you guys want us to do more Dominican mukbangs, you could definitely do a race. <laughs> Rice beans will attempt to do it very, very good. Like I made beans for the first time the other day. It came out pretty decent, so I think we could put something together. Yeah, we could defend ourselves. <laughs> yeah, okay. But all right, guys, thank you. Peace.